supercarrier getting ready to take off. Already got to go ahead to start throttling up, but doing some last checks. And I really wanted to demonstrate the uh, the new clouds. And all that good stuff on a nice, long, relaxing flight. Let me get my thing set up. Okay. Everything's looking pretty good. Try to get a little better. Seating. So you can see a little bit more of the cockpit. Try to... Okay. So I'm gonna start throttling up. I'm going to give the salute. <laughs> kind of weird having my thing set so far back here. Usually much closer. some altitude and then I'm gonna go into autopilot okay I'll back off my speed a little bit plan was to do this, fly back to Ramat David Airport, land at the, or Air Base, and land there, and uh, that would be it. Every time I do this, so by the time I already get here, I'm kind of like, yeah, just end up stopping. It's very relaxing, but I don't know if I can sit here for the return trip. Clouds are absolutely beautiful, but it obscures the ground too, so it makes it hard to appreciate some of the uh, scenery. Don't get me wrong though, clouds are awesome. But one of the cool things when you're doing like a long trip like this in autopilot, you can mess around with the FLIR, look at the different buildings and everything. Three, two, one, and range. So, yet again, the other one didn't fire, but now it will. And now I'm going to jump out and follow the missiles. Looks like the other one might get there first, so let me jump over to that one.
There it is. Yep, don't think it's gonna make it. I think those guys are probably dead in that command center. Yep, they're dead. So. Alright, let's go back to HSI. Let's go to. Look at that, making the return trip and don't even have to steer. So, I think that I'm gonna call today. Um, got a good idea of what happened there. And, I think that's it, everyone have a good, uh, good Sunday, thank you.